everybody uh, this is a <laughs> quick video on what not to do uh, to cut a long story short I bought this telescope uh, last year sometime and I hadn't even got it out and looking I hadn't even observed through it not looked through it, anything through it and all I was doing well I would got this old eyepiece that I was cleaning up uh, see I've separated it here I was cleaning this old eyepiece up and I hadn't fastened the barrel back properly and the scope was in level position but the eyepiece was upright it was it was twisted round and you can imagine what happened uh, this fell out straight through and unfortunately I don't know if we can get this um, maybe if we can turn the flash on or something Excuse me one moment. You know, there we go. If we can get that without reflecting, you'll see the secondary. Can you see that? The secondary mirror, it's right down there. Uh, if I can get my finger in to point it. Just there. On the end of my finger. Which, I was very lucky really, because it didn't hit smack in the center but it has taken you get that in a little bit further i don't know if it's picking up quite a chunk out of the bottom of the secondary now that was just an accident it really was an accident i had you know stupidity really i hadn't attached this barrel back on properly but it you, you really must uh always level your scope when you're um, doing anything, especially around the spider here, um, you know, when you're attaching it, any any Allen keys, uh, the adjustment spanners, whatever you want to call them, here they fall down. Your primary is scratched. It's simple as that, or worse, chipped. <laughs> um, like I say, I've kind of got away with it. Um, if there is such a thing as getting away with breaking your second rim mirror. Anyway, that's uh, enough of my stupidity. Seize you all later.